hundreds of thousands more that we anticipate receiving. Uh, but we now, obviously, based on what we've heard in the last 24 hours, want to confirm uh, that those doses indeed are available. And public health officials in Yolo County tell me they don't even have enough doses for their health care workers who are first in line. We do not have enough vaccines in Yolo County. We're actually going to run out of vaccines probably either at the end of this week or early next week. Yolo County spokesperson Jenny Tan says the county is now considering ways on how they can stretch their limited supplies with the news of a halt on shipments. We do have some second doses that we've reserved and we really want to keep it as second doses. But what the news may mean is that we may need to think about maybe some other strategies if we want to use second doses as first doses, you know, really talking about is it better to have people that are halfway vaccinated <laughs> or to have people that are completely vaccinated. Dr. Brad Pollock is Associate Dean for Public Health Sciences at UC Davis and says one dose is better than none. They know that there's evidence that you will get antibody response. It's not the same as a full dose, okay? And it's not the same as two doses. Um, but the question is whether that less, less of that response is actually gonna be translated into fewer infections and fewer deaths.